Yo, what's going on guys, Swift Guy here, and welcome back to another video. Now this video is going to be a little bit different. I'm going to be going over some of the recent controversy surrounding myself. A lot of people uh, might have seen a video by uh, someone in particular that thinks I cheat based on one of my videos. It was literally two hits. So I'm just going to be going over that and some of the reactions to that. Um, I was never banned for this. Um, a lot of people thought I was banned, especially since I jokingly posted a ban screen on the forums that was clearly faked. But, um, yes, yeah, so we're going to be going over some of people's uh, comments and reactions, and uh, I'll be debunking why none of this is uh, accurate. So first, we've got the recent video that went up. It's my Insane Gank plus Phoenix Vo Broken Mega Wall's comeback video. So here, I'll just show you what he says. This hit right here. Boom. Look at that. Very clearly cheating. So you can see that, like, um the hit is registering on that player as uh, my crosshair is way off the hitbox of the player, which is, you know, surrounding the player model a little bit outside of the player model, but obviously not that far out. Clearly cheating. His his crosshair is like a, full, a teammate hit him. He, get, he got in. And then he's pointing out that I got energy, so that was me hitting him. And obviously you can see I got particles from that. And then hit. he's pointing out this hit over here. Um, gonna... I got energy again. And... Uh, Obviously, my crosshair is way off the person, and he's basically saying that I'm cheating, you know. So basically, that's the, the main proof that everybody's been saying I'm cheating, like they're not surprised that I'm cheating or whatever. But if we actually go to the video, as you can see, um, I'm clicking 9 CPS, so it's constantly clicking. And as we go over him, right there, like we, we're right outside of that player model, and we got uh, particles on him so obviously we weren't hitting through him that'd be like killer or something but um we got right outside of his player model and the click registered on his player and um this right here and you could see we got particles but then it takes a second and then it registers obviously you can see that i got the hit the energy went up but my crosshair is way off because i was swinging my mouse like across my uh, mouse pad and the hit registered late i mean it there's a delay on hypixel if you've ever played hypixel you know like the delay is pretty significant and then if we watch this in normal speed it's actually looks pretty fine like i just swung right across him and it looked like it registered almost immediately because of how fast i was swinging my mouse it looked like um you know if you put it in really slow motion that i could be cheating or whatever um because the hit registers as my crosshair is not on him. So that was the first hit, and then the second hit, right here, you can see we have crosshairs right on him. We're getting CPS. We got particles while our crosshair was still on him, and the particles are coming out, and then now the hit registers right there. But yeah, you can see that we got that hit, but uh, it was because our crosshair was on him, and it just moved over. So it's clearly uh, terrible evidence on his part. I don't know why people are believing this. All right, so now we're going to go to the second video of uh, where people usually say that I was cheating in the ban for blacklisted modifications video. Um, basically, E4 uploaded this by uh, it was originally made by Afri or Afri Shimas. Some people might know him, but basically he's pointing out that I was in F5. I was looking one direction, and then I spun around and like I did 180 and started swinging at the bot that was like behind me in the wall. And he's trying to explain that I did it too fast. Um, I was like, there's no way I could have known it was there. But the ironic thing is I was actually trying to trim down the video and uh, make it like shorter because a lot of the video was me swinging at the hitbox. You could see I saw it swing behind me. And I looked in that 5 I could see it back there. And then I turned around and hit it. In the original video, you didn't see it swing behind me. or And so that's why I, when I did F5, I swung back and did that. But I cut it out of the video so you couldn't tell. And that's why a lot of people were thinking us cheating, which didn't make a whole lot of sense. But yeah, that's that. This was in 2016 as well. All right, so this uh, video that uh, Moto made on me kind of applies to what something Technoblade made in 2016, over two years ago, uh, Safe Aura, which is basically like kind of what it looked like I might have been using. Most people are saying hitboxes. They're essentially the same thing. You look close to the hitbox and it'll register the hit. But basically, he points out multiple examples in other YouTubers' videos of this happening, and then replicates it himself on the server. Here, I'll just show you a little clip. So we're going to play this in slow motion. Basically, my working theory is that it registers you as clicking on them, and then the hit is really delayed, because that's the only thing that makes sense. But keep in mind, I actually don't know what's going on. I just know what's going on. 
So basically, he clicks on this guy through the lightning, and then the hit happens here when he's way out of, way out of hitbox. Way out of hitbox again. It, it really all right, so that's basically the entire like what the video is. Basically, you the click is on your client. You have your crosshair on the player within range, and you click. It hits the player, but on the server, from your client to the server, there's latency, so it takes time for it to actually register. So if you're moving your mouse around a lot, you could move your mouse by the like way over to the left or to the right or whatever, wherever off of the hitbox before it registers if you're fast enough, and that's just how the servers work. All right, so this was all, all of these posts I've had open, but a lot of them have been taken down, obviously. So was with Guy Van for cheating? How much did Moto pay for this to happen? Um, he said, "Don't need to pay anyone." He's cheating his own videos, and he links his video of uh, me 100% cheating. You know, a couple of people are saying delayed hits. Uh, the hits are delayed. Obviously, hits are delayed. You know, there's latency between the client and the server side when it registers your hit. Uh, but obviously you could see at normal speed it wasn't actually that long. Um, doesn't seem like enough to ban someone. Uh, some people are saying that, but he said that the report was accepted and logged out the exact minute. It was, and at the moment when the his report of me cheating was accepted, I logged out. So I'm pretty sure he's lying. I mean, I did log out like earlier that day, but I don't know. I think he's just trying to... In my opinion, I think he's trying to tarnish my reputation, make me look bad, and like try and discredit me from future videos, because obviously I have um, clips of him cheating again, and I've already made one video of him cheating. And then Bone Void's defending me, said again, delayed hits. Uh, the coincidence of me logging out when the appeal was quote-unquote accepted. I mean, they, they don't say if the, your or report was accepted, they just say thanks for the report. They don't say if they banned them or not. Um, he said it's probably coincidence. Um, Staff team is corrupt if they did ban me. Uh, this guy said, you're such a fanboy and you can't recognize reality. He plays with Rico Vids and Bandit, get a clue. So obviously this guy does not like me. Um, obviously this dude's just defending me and he calls him a fanboy that doesn't recognize reality, uh, discrediting him for uh, defending me. Um, he plays with Rico Vids. I actually do play with Rico or have played with Rico and Vids. I never played with Bandit because obviously Bandit cheats really hard. Uh, to my knowledge, Rico and Vids do not cheat. But they possibly could. I mean, if evidence comes out of them cheating, I'm not obviously not going to play with them. I haven't played with them any time recently, though. And then he go, they go back and forth. There's video evidence, no need for an argument. You're simply a fanboy who refuses to recognize that your Minecraft idol is secretly a cheater. Um, again, like, there's no evidence that this dude is a fanboy or just blinded by, like, me being an, his idol or whatever. He's literally just defending me with logical arguments, and uh, this dude is discrediting him for that. Uh, I've told people for a while that Swift is cheating, like, hello? And then, oh, my brother, Japan ping my ass. Obviously, that's a reference to Cooper, who <laughs> was a beehopping shaman, a friend of mine. And uh, he said Japan ping when he, like, was beehopping or whatever. So I said that when this dude accusated me a couple months ago, a couple weeks ago, I don't know. Obviously, it's a joke, and he's saying that, like, just imitating me for saying Japan ping. Okay, so on the second thread, Swift guy permanent. I don't seem to have the first page, but I have the second page. Um, if Swift has banned, the staff team's corrupt. He's literally using timer on the city and hit me through blocks, but cut it out of the video. That's false. I actually didn't have it in the video. I'm pretty sure I either didn't record that part because it was before my wither was dead, or I didn't put it in the video because my wither was still alive, and I don't re usually um, put final kills when my wither's alive in the video because that's kind of lame. Pretty sure staff are actually supposed to ban people who are cheating. You don't seem to understand what their job is in response to the staff team being corrupt. The irony of that statement, because uh, this dude is a well-known cheater and has cheated for a long time and still not banned. And then we move on to news alert. Swift guy isn't banned, thanks staff. And this dude, Moto says, yeah, got his corrupt staff friends to unban him already. Gotta make a follow-up video. He's saying that he's going to make another video on me. Um, first of all, I wasn't banned in the first place. And I don't have many staff friends. I'd say maybe two or three at most and i don't talk to them like ever and then this dude defended me saying swift seems fairly legit more legit than moto at least maybe so but he hits me through blocks and kills moto and vampirical by using timer when calling it japan ping it's pretty obvious he's not legit um obviously japan ping is a joke um <laughs> you know it's a reference to cooper again 
but obviously I am legit. I don't cheat, never have. Uh, I was, I, re I remember the game, and uh, I was just, I literally just chased him down and killed him. Like, I don't think there's anything sketchy about it. This dude's saying, um, who doesn't hack in Mega Walls and get, doesn't get banned for it these days, which is a pretty accurate statement, except it doesn't apply to me. This dude responded to Vegas saying, so guy's legit to go F yourself if you think he is, which, um, some people are just so blindsided by their dislike for me. Like, I understand if you don't like me, that's fine. You go ahead and hate me all you want. But, like, just saying I'm not legit because you don't like me doesn't make sense. Then we got a post by Zuzum saying White Knight isn't as good as some of you may think. Uh, why he was banned, obviously I wasn't banned. This was a message on uh, Discord with him. He said, do you get banned? I responded, yep. Okay, and we're using blacklist modifications. Uh, no, I was... No, but that was what the ban reason was. I don't cheat, is what I said. Obviously, I'm messing with him. I didn't get banned. That was a troll on forums. Doesn't look definitive, in my opinion, from uh, Moto's video right here. But he says he's denied cheating against indisputable proof before. And we'll go into that with this video, is what I'm pretty sure he's talking about, the ban for blacklisted modifications video, where you might remember I did get banned by staff for seven days on it when I was on an alt, trying to record other cheaters, ironically enough. But I did get unbanned when I uh, gave them gave the video to this to them in the appeal so uh i don't know that's indisputable proof but we're going to go over that and once i finish these forums quick swift has been harassing moto for hacking even after moto admitted to it and stopped tables have turned and swift got hit with 30 a day and now everyone's attacking moto again sometimes the truth is right in front of our eyes but we can't accept it because it isn't familiar and then he links the ban for blacklist and modifications video he also denied cheating in this video even though nine out of ten people can clearly see he's using aimbot uh, I don't know about that one. I mean, most people don't seem to think I'm cheating there. It could be really delayed hits, but for his ping, it looks sketchy. Again, the taking out of context, it does look really delayed, but it's actually not. Zid says the video looks suspicious in the fact that he's not even looking at his target. I, if you watch the video, you could tell I did look at the target, and then I did move past him because I, I mean, obviously I don't have aim lock. I'm using my hand to track my mouse and try and follow him, but um, I don't know much at all either but from what other people say about how he denied and resents cheating with proof against him might just be his best way of saving himself so basically he's trying to say that by cheating myself i try and divert the attention on the other cheaters to save myself and then he said if he wants to fight the proof then he will need proof of himself which he likely won't have well the proof was in my own video so i don't know how you want me to have another recording of my own video that doesn't really make sense and then Duel responds by saying exposing someone else is basically equal to trying super hard to get negative attention off of yourself, trying to debunk this guy's argument that Moto is just seeking attention, which he is, and trying to tarnish my reputation. Um, obviously, this isn't always true, a true statement, but it is true for the situation. I think that's kind of a broad statement to try and use against somebody. This dude counters somebody's statement that Moto cheats with the fact that Moto cheats doesn't have anything to do with undeniable proof of Swift cheating. It's really undeniable. I uh, got a zero-day ban for that. Basically, if you didn't know who uploaded the video, you would have been convinced that he was cheating. Uh, I don't think it matters who uploads the video. I mean, just in this situation, it's kind of obvious <laughs> what uh, the intention was, considering the evidence was really bad. And Killing says, Moto never stopped cheating to Zuzum. Uh, literally didn't cheat for a week, thought it was too hard to cheat again. Um, Zuzum responds by, please show me a video of him clearly cheating after he admitted to it, which, if you didn't know, I made a cheater exposed on Moto, he got banned for two weeks, and then he came back, made a thread, explaining that he cheated, but has since removed all the text from it and started cheating again. Uh, I have a new Hypixel cheater exposed, number 13, coming out soon, including people like Moto, Z-Bandit, uh, Nicholas, um, Link the Tiger, even though Link already got banned like a couple days ago. So yeah, I have under <laughs> I have some pretty obvious proof of Moto cheating, so that's really quite ridiculous. And another thread, did you get permanent? I just said 30 days, I was still trolling at this point. And um, this dude says, was it false? Like, was it a false ban? He said, blacklisted modification, banned by a mod or higher. Very low chance that it was a false ban. No offense, Swift. Uh, it, well, it wasn't a false ban because there was no ban. So, <laughs> surprise, meme review. Sasuku said that evidence that got him banned wasn't concrete. I'm surprised he got banned for it. Um, the suit responded by saying it's enough evidence he literally recorded himself hitboxing. Definitely hitboxing. Um, on any properly run server, he would have been permed. People have gotten stopped white for uploading cheating videos, and yet he does the same but gets 30 day. Actually, that's really inaccurate. 
um, not on any properly run server, but on most uh, HCF servers. It's a perm ban for cheating, obviously, first offense. Uh, people have gotten stat wiped for uploading cheating videos. Mostly that's the people who be hopped on alts, not people who cheated on their main. And um, a first offense ban for cheating is not 30 days anyways. All right, so that's basically all I have. Um, if you have any questions or comments or feedback, let me know in the comments down below. I'll answer uh, any questions you guys have about any of the topics on the forums or either of the two videos of me quote unquote cheating. Um, I will say it again, and I will continue to say this. I have never cheated, and I never will. So, yeah, that's all. If you guys enjoyed, make sure to leave a like and subscribe for more content. Let me know if you want more videos like this of me um, going through and talking about specific topics or events on the forums or anywhere else. And I will see you guys next time. Peace. Oh, one thing I forgot. I just like to show you that I am not banned from the server. And as you can see on the appeals, um, my last one was in 2017 for a mute. I haven't made any ban appeals, so obviously I wasn't banned. Just like to point that out.